Well, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be talking about a book that I've had for a while. And you can find this book in most large bookstores. Of course, you can find it online also. This is called Prescription for Nutritional Healing, and it's the fifth edition by Phyllis A. Balk, and she's a CNC. It was revised and updated by Stacy Bell. Now, this is a very large book. It's about, I'm going to say, um, two inches thick, two and a half inches thick. It is not a flashy book. It's black and white, uh, ink, uh, black ink on paper. But the information is very thorough. It's very detailed. Uh, it's not something you might sit down and read unless you enjoy this type of thing but it has a lot of good information as it says it's a practical practical a to z reference to drug-free remedies using vitamins minerals herbs and food supplements this is not medical advice i am not giving any type of medical advice at all Please check with your doctor before you use any natural remedies, uh, just in case it might interact with any prescriptions that you are currently taking or you might be allergic to. This is a good reference man manual to have on your shelf anytime, not only for grid down, SHTF, compromising situations, this is good to have on your shelf just in case you want to look something up, uh, become familiar with the book, maybe buy some of those little tabs, uh, like a post-it note flag, tab what you normally would reference or need to reference uh, in, in a quick minute. It would be a large book to carry in your bug out bag. I'm sure there are smaller ones that are more compact that could be carried that don't weigh as much. Uh, this one weighs quite a bit. And like I said, it's about, I'll say three, 400, about 300 pages. If this is something that you might use, look it up online, look it up in your local bookstore. I bought this one at a local bookstore. Like I said, years ago, it ran about $35. It's well worth every penny. Uh, I have a library of different books, gardening books, nutritional books, natural healing books. It just makes it easier for me to look things up. I also have some books on different medications, prescription medications. Um, it's, a, it's a manual that shows, like a dictionary that shows all the different symptoms of conditions and what medication might be used for them. This book was used to train medical coders. That was their reference, one of the reference books they had. Uh, it seemed like a great thing to have. About eight years ago, it was $50. I have no idea how much it is now. It's just a big green dictionary, hardback. If this is something that you might use, again, look it up online, have it on your shelf, read through it periodically. If you have any suggestions of other books within this realm, please put it in the comments. I am sure the subscribers and viewers would love to hear all the different options that you have, things that you've collected over the years, or things that you found uh, on on the shelf within the last few months or years. I am so glad you stopped by today. Again, to my new subscribers, I welcome you. And to my subscribers, I welcome you back. Share this video with your friends and family if you enjoyed it. If you think that this is some information that you might need or they might want to, to have on their shelf. This is just one of my gentle reminders that I'm going to start each day, each morning, I'm going to have a gentle reminder of things that I have found that might help you. 
Uh, a lot of people have asked me in the comments, but also uh, in person and on the phone and email and uh, text, you know, where do I start? I haven't done anything. What do I do to start prepping? I, I said, well, I'm a planner. So preppers plan. And the first thing I did was make a plan. Don't try to tackle it all at once. Tackle it a small bite at a time. Again, thank you for watching. I appreciate your, your views and your comments. And I hope to see you very soon.